Hello everyone, this is Heratlania. Welcome back to my playthrough of Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix for the PS3. Previously, Aqua finished up in Disney Town. So now it's time for Terra to move on to the next world, Olympus Colosseum. Olympus Coliseum is over here, past Disney Town. Visit this world. Uh oh. Stay back. Pick on someone your own size on first. Take out all the unversed. Magnega levels up. Gather. Thunder. Wind. Goodbye, Unversed. You okay? Huh? Yeah, thanks. <sighs> Guess they were too much for me. I'm just gonna have to train harder. You're pretty tough. It really handled those things. Are you here to enter the games? What games? The games games. To see who's strongest. One day, I'm gonna win them all and become a true hero. Hank! Where are you? Front and center right now, or I'm tacking on another thousand laps. <laughs> Uh-oh. Gotta go. The Coliseum's just up ahead. I, I hope I get to see you fight there sometime! A competition. Hmm. I should find out how strong I really am. And welcome to Olympus Coliseum. Now with a younger Hercules. We start in the town near Thebes. Let's check the perimeter. Including these urns. Busting up pottery. Now let's move on. Oh dear. Jeez Louise, one chump after another. Like a who's who of decapolon disasters around here. All I need is one measly warrior tough enough to give Zeus a jolt of his own medicine. Wait. Dark, moody, powerful? Yes, he's perfect. This is it. 
How sad is this? Huh? Uh, uh, mm, pains me to see it. <laughs> All that power going to waste. Who are you? Name is Hades, Lord of the Dead, God of the Underworld, yada yada, how you doing? Hey, let me guess. You're trying to put the kibosh on the darkness inside you. Am I right? Of course I'm right. Well, anyway, bad idea. Wait, what? Okay, stay with me. Darkness is inside everybody. Nothing to be ashamed of. You play nice with it, and darkness will be your best friend. But if you go and get all self-conscious and refuse to face it, the darkness will run over you like a debutante at a toga sale. And then where are you? Nowhere. Now me, I look at you, and I see potential. That's right, kid. You got the potential to conquer the darkness inside you. And I'll even give you some pointers. I mean, believe me, if anybody knows conquering, I know conquering. <laughs> well, let's hear it then. How do I conquer the darkness? Easy. You sign up for the games. I know, I know. Please, Lord Hades, the games. But hey, you would be surprised what you can learn in the heat of battle. And don't worry, I'll be right there to guide you every step of the way. I'm kind of what you'd call an expert in the art of darkness. Oh, decide fast. This is a limited time offer. I don't think so, Hades. We're now at the Colosseum Gates. In this corner, we have a treasure chest with a Mega Potion. Around back here, there's another chest with a Mega Attack Recipe. A recipe list that reveals what you will create if your melding combination will result in an advanced attack command. And another chest over here with Fire Strike. And we have a sticker high up. A balloon sticker. Magnega has reached the maximum level, so its defender ability is now yours to keep. Aroga has reached the maximum level, so its reload boost ability is now yours to keep. Fire Strike. Cloak the Keyblade in fire and perform a spinning attack at the enemy. Now let's head inside. And we're in the vestibule. There's Hades, his high and mightiness. And this chest contains... the Olympus Colosseum map. A shop and a save point. Now let's check out that sticker we found outside. Arrange stickers. This one. There we are. And that is the one sticker from Olympus Coliseum for Terra. Now let's talk to Hades and get this farce started. Time to close this deal. Yeah, I guess so. When are you going to tell me how to conquer the darkness? Hold your chariot horses. You would not believe the bureaucracy involved with these things. Name? Terra. Kind of earthy, but all right. <laughs> now. Height and weight. What's this? Favorite god? <laughs> Come on. Hades. There. Ba-boom. Easy peasy. 
I sense that you're already starting to get all warm and fuzzy with that darkness inside you. It's sweet, really. And hey, by the time you win the final match here, you'll have figured out how to conquer it for good. And don't worry, anything goes wrong, I'll make it all go away. Service with a smile. I got it. <laughs> Looking a bit smug there, Hades. Defeat your opponents within the time limit. Round one, three scrappers. Surprise! Round two, a bruiser and a vile file. Stop car levels up. Round three, three spider chests. Got a shimmering crystal. Round four, a buckle bruiser. Gather. Thunder. Wind. Goodbye. Round five, five shoegazers. Gather. Thunder. How shocking. Round six, red hot chilies, blue sea salts, yellow mustards, and an axe flapper. Goodbye. Round seven, three buckle bruisers. You're done. Take that. You're done. Take that. Bye bye. Round eight, two mono truckers and two chrono twisters. Payback Fang levels up. Goodbye. Round nine, a bruiser and five mandrakes. Gather. Fire. Freeze. Fire. Bye bye. And round ten, a whopping thirty jelly shades. Enjoy some diamond dust, guys. Gather. Bonus obtained, maximum HP increased. Obtained Sonic Impact. Use Sonic Impact to slide repeatedly and knock your way past enemies. While sliding, press square to crash through enemies. Install Sonic Impact underneath commands like Air Slide or Ice Slide. Very good, Terra. A little more HP. Just a tad. And a new action command. Sonic Impact. Let us put that here as well. Let's see... Perhaps Poison Edge? Maybe we'll try Zero Gravira for what's coming up? Alrighty, Terra. Alright, Hades, let's continue. Next step is the big one, the final. You ready? Yeah.
Okay, this is not what I had in mind. Uh, but hey, I can improvise. Time for plan beta. Pardon me, coming through. I'm gonna miss my match. Hello, plan beta. Hey, kid! Huh? Over here. Come here. Oh, boy. Once I've conquered the darkness in my heart, I'll never have to fear it again. The sky looks familiar. Even with that helmet on. Defeat the mysterious soldier. Enjoy some fire. Mysterious soldier. Bye bye, mysterious soldier. Super Warrior, see, right here, this, it's the power of darkness. Could have been yours, still could, if you open up to it. Hades! You were just playing me. The darkness will never have me. Help me. You've got to set my heart free. Dread that Hades. Defeat the soldier and free him from Hades' control. Come on! 
Take that, Zack. Yes, that is Zack from Final Fantasy VII. You all better now, Zack? Forget it. It looks like I bet on the wrong dark horse. That kid doesn't have what it takes to handle darkness. You gonna make it? Yeah. Yeah. I'm finally free. Where is... He's gone. Man, how can I let a guy like him control me? I'll never live it down. <laughs> Thanks. Um... Tara. Thanks, Tara. I'm Zack. Hmm. Yep. Definitely. Tara, you're exactly what I pictured a hero would be. Not the way you look. There's something else about you. Well, I'm no hero. Trust me. Are you kidding? Listen to those cheers, man. You don't get to decide if you're a hero or not. They do. And they've already made up their mind. Whether you like it or not, you're their hero. <laughs> and mine, too. It's too bad. I really wanted to fight you fair and square. Maybe someday, Zack. <laughs> Forged a D-Link with Zack. We obtained the Keyblade, Mark of a Hero, a Keyblade that provides an extra boost in strength and deals higher damage when you land a critical hit. And that concludes the Olympus Coliseum for Terra, with 100% of treasures. So we have a new Keyblade, Mark of a Hero. Better strength, definitely. Slightly worse magic, though. I think I'll stay with what I've got for now. And Terra now has a D-Link with Zack. The command deck is a fiery spin attack. The finish is a ground shockwave. Hero's entrance. And reports. Story. Olympus Coliseum. After rescuing a boy named Hercules, who was being attacked by Unversed, Terra learned about the games, a competition where he might test his strength. Intrigued, Terra made his way to the Coliseum, where the games were being held, and outside its doors he met Hades, god of the underworld. Hades insisted on entering Terra in the games, promising to teach him how to conquer the darkness inside him and gain great power. Terra fought his way through the brackets, but much to Hades' displeasure, he did so without relying on the darkness inside him. Annoyed, Hades enslaved Terra's opponent in the finals, Zack, turning him into a warrior of darkness. It was a brutal fight for Terra, but in the end, he prevailed and set Zack's heart free without calling upon the darkness. Hades muttered about he bet on the wrong dark horse and disappeared, while Zack, awed by the young man who had saved him, proclaimed Terra hero of the whole town. Then we have character files, Olympus Coliseum, Hercules. From Hercules of 1997 a boy with tremendous strength who goes by Herc for short. He was born a god, but someone kidnapped him when he was a baby, and ever since, he has lived down on Earth as a mortal. After learning he can rejoin the gods on Olympus if he becomes a true hero, he asked Phil to train him, and has been hard at work ever since. Not as big and bulky yet as in Kingdom Hearts, Philoctetes, 
a renowned trainer of heroes who has whipped countless hopefuls into shape. For a while, he had written off the whole hero business, but Hercules talked him out of retirement. And a good thing, too. Then Hades, god of the underworld. He is scheming to overthrow Zeus, ruler of Olympus, and take over the world. Hades would like nothing better than to find a powerful mortal he can fast talk into helping him achieve his ambitions. He was not on fire today. Zack, from Crisis Core and Final Fantasy VII. A boy who longs to become a hero. Hades manipulated him and turned him into a warrior of darkness, but Zack's heart was freed when Terra defeated him. Under the Unversed, we now have Mono Trucker. These road warriors zoom around and pick a fight with pickaxes. It's hard to get a bead on a Mono Trucker if it's too far away, so find the right time to move in, then finish it off in one fell swoop. Shelly Shade. These floaters are known to attack in groups, and sometimes even entire colonies. Each color is weak against a different element, making it hard to put the kibosh on their collective jiggle. When in doubt, start smacking them with the keyblade. Then, yellow mustard. Don't expect these crafty condiments to hold still. You'll need to lock on if you want your blows to connect. Use blizzard attacks to chill them out. Also, don't be that guy or gal who gets slammed by an electrified yellow mustard. It's so difficult to explain to friends. Must be pretty shocking. Buckle Bruiser. Buckles, who knew? Sadly, they serve a purpose. Keeping this bruiser's sturdy armor strapped on, head-on attacks won't work. You'll need to get behind it to hit its weak spot, try magic, but don't get careless just because it's slow. Buckle rhymes with knuckle, which rhymes with pain, which you'll be seeing a lot of if you're not ready to block. Then Axe Flapper. These baddies launch razor-sharp gusts of wind at you faster than you can say Axe Flapper. Keep your distance, and give yourself room to dodge. Beware! Just because you've taken one down, doesn't mean you've taken it out. Get hasty and wander too close, and it will counter with a rising slash. Alrighty. And treasures! We have collected all the Olympus Colosseum treasures. There weren't that many. And there was just one sticker. In the next episode, we'll start Ventus's part of Olympus Colosseum. This is Heyrotlinia. I'd like to thank you for watching, and I will see you again next time.